Go ahead. All right. Now we're after the first stop here. Nobody has hit the kicker, so the ball is considered in the air. At this point, the Dolphins could call a fake and throw the ball. If you remember, the two outside guys were Mandich here and McMichael. They're the only two players eligible to receive a pass. Obviously, the Dolphins aren't throwing to McMichael in this case, and Mandich is covered very well by Palomalu. And that's why you have him on the, on the felt there, to keep the offense honest. If a guy wanted to, he could have lined up 11 guys on the line and tried to get the kick. But again, you run the risk of having a receiver wide open. So, in this case, the Dolphins are not faking the kick. Nobody hit a Lindo Mari. So basically, we ignore everything here. The only thing we're concentrating now is on the football going through the uprights. After the first stoppage, the ball is allowed to be adjusted. You're allowed to aim it. That is only after the first stoppage. On the second and third stoppages, where it goes is where it goes. Now what we're looking for is if the ball goes through the uprights, the field goal is good, and the Dolphins would have kicked a 38-yard field goal. If the ball goes wide, hits the upright directly and goes out, that's a missed kick. If the ball were to fall short, that is a miss as well. So we'll run the board here for the second stop. I don't think we're going to need a third one. But if we ran a third one, the ball just wouldn't be adjusted. So we'll run it through and we'll see if the kick goes through. <laughs> and the ball goes through the uprights. That is a field goal for the Dolphins. Easy as that. And the system is very simple. And that's how we do it.